this was kind of a rough start to this Utah-UCLA game. Utah gets up by three, about 422 left in the first quarter. And I can't tell what the defensive assignments were here because you've got a D tackle who gets on the inside gap or the B gap. You've got your end who stays on the outside. And in between these two right here, I don't know who's got this gap. Chase is going to get locked up. Javelin Guidry is going to get locked up. Julian Blackman is going to get locked up. And it was just great blocking across the front. Look at this. Everybody's locked up right there. Across the board. Fighting to the outside, but locked up. Maybe in the wrong gap, but I, I can't tell. It's just they didn't have... I don't know if Chase was supposed to fire down in this gap. But that gap remains wide open, and everybody is just locked up, and that goes for a quick touchdown. So then, you come right back, and Utah doesn't realize yet that they can just run it and score at will, and you get a really nice pocket. You get a decent look, but you've got a P.I. right here. And then that defender just jumps back and intercepts that ball. But there was no question that there's a P.I. on this play right, right there. You can't really see it. It's right there below. But he basically stops him in his route and then jumps backwards. And they don't get the call. They get the interception. So kind of a, see right there, that's that's impeding the route. And you can't do that. Basically jammed the route and then jumped up and caught that ball. Refs didn't call it, so it is what it is. Rough start, but they overcame it well.